Hey everybody, here we are for game two, and uh, boy, I didn't see that planes there in the middle for a second. I thought this was a horrible hand. It's not a great hand, but it's a, it's a keepable hand. White, oh, we're siding in Gideon's defeat. Planes, holy deck, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. This is a hand that I, in some cases, would... <laughs> I don't want leagues to go away. I love that people have the option to play leagues if that works out for them. That's awesome. And leagues should stick around. But we should have the option to not play leagues. And not play the same deck back to back to back to back to back. That's all I ask. What you gonna play? Mommy Paramount. Sure. Haven't seen enough of that yet. <clears throat> Hit me for two. Youch. And then draw not a land. Just not a land. Ne pas de la land. Lande? It's a fancy land at least. I guess there's that going for it. Let's pass the turn. We'll hold up the steward. If they drop a zombie, we'll exert... Well, we'll wait for them to target the steward, and then we'll exert the steward. Otherwise, they would just target the one one that we made off the steward. What zombie do you have on four? <clears throat> we have no zombie on four. You're hitting me for four. Boy. I'll take four. Yeah. Stuart is slow. Stuart is real, real slow. Just far too slow for this format. Uh, yeah, I'll discard a card. Gladly. You've got it, opponent. Holy crap on a frigging crutch. Uh, let's cycle that land. Into a Sidewinder Naga that we can't cast. Pass the turn. This is why I'm not instantly keeping uh, five landers all the time. And especially not six landers. Ooh, if near, if near Deadlands. Tap my warrior, hit me for five. I do not believe that we're going to be allowed to play magic this game. I do believe we are just dead. Rub it in, opponent. <laughs> Rub it in. Uh, synchronized strike. Welp. We're going to drop a bitter bow. And we're going to pass the turn. They've got If Near Deadlands online to kill off a warrior and then play. No, they can't play a zombie and do that. They can play a one mana zombie and do that and tap that and get in for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, lethal. <laughs> <clears throat> they are pretty close to lethal. So next turn at least we can drop Sidewinder and hold up Synchronized Strike, I guess. Just gonna... Oh, maybe they're just gonna... Yeah, they're just gonna drop the Bitter Bows down to two. And that way they attack with team and I have to trade or else I die. Oh. Yeah, I'll take two. That's fine. That's fine. Give me a camel. Or an ambuscade. That's also kind of a thing. Alright, so we'll drop that. And we'll pass the turn. <clears throat> Ooh. 
and we can try to get back into this maybe. I'm gonna make a one one, sure. Uh, I believe getting back into this utterly requires a camel. We need that lifelink. Lifelink on a creature that can hit in a little bit. Another desert. So is that gonna be the end of Monsieur Bitterbo? Plus, this stupid thing can, be, can become a 3-4. Um, okay, you're going to kill that instead, you say. Well, so I could keep it alive for the turn, and then they just wouldn't attack. I could Ambuscade, kill that, and then maybe they don't attack in. Yeah, let's do that. Let's Ambuscade maybe prevent them from attacking in, I hope, maybe, please. <clears throat> Ugh. I will take two. Come on, camel, even though the camel will snap die. Whoo! Oh, the camel! Monsieur Camel. Um, I'm gonna get in for two here. Yeah, in for damage. Um, yeah, we just make a zombie. Make a zombie. We could hold up Synchronized Strike, which would like keep the camel alive, but that would not do enough. It would keep it alive for the turn until at the end of turn and it would die. Actually, no, we, we wouldn't even... We, eh, hmm? Yeah, yeah, it, it would work. But then they just wouldn't attack and I still would not gain the life. <gasps> Passing the turn? You're saying there's a chance. Um, yeah, let's go in and in. What are you doing? What are you doing? Start. Okay, but you can't finish. You cannot yet finish. make another one one and then you're what you're gonna quadruple block or you're gonna double double block double block well I can eat all the warriors with the synchronized strike and gain five life go back to ten that is what we're gonna do goodbye warriors back to ten all right, step one completed. <laughs> step two, not happening. Don't be a land. Uh, sure, we can't really attack or anything, so may as well drop something that can block and kill, or block with something else to kill the strider. And now we're waiting for Overcome, or Appeal to Authority, or Trial of Solidarity, or something like that. Something along those lines. You gonna kill my beast? Unraveling Mummy. <coughs> Ugh. My camel, no! He didn't do anything. Camel is okay, you shouldn't tap him down like that. Spider-Man wannabe zombie. All right, what you gonna do? You gonna come in with your Strider? You gonna come in with your mummy? Do your worst, or do less than your worst, but do something. Okay, we can top deck another camel. We can top deck appeal to authority, make this camel gigantic. 
one, two, three, four, five, six. It would be a nine powered trample camel. That would be these. All right, so we can beast and zombie. We can beast zombie to get rid of that threat. And then we could stalwart warrior to get rid of that threat. Or is sharpshooter warrior the better choice? That leaves us with two creatures to their three creatures. Um, no, I think we just take seven. Or I, I think we just take three here and kill off the strider. Go to seven. And then you're going to get lifelink. Go to 21. Sure. All right. Empty Joe. Be cool. Be cool. Be cool. Be cool. Yeah, you're cool. I mean, you're cool-ish. You're cool adjacent. Um, all right. Do we come in with camel and just get some life back here? Come in with camel. Come in with stalwart. No, don't come in with stalwart. Just with camel. If he makes a warrior and chumps, I'm totally fine with that. <clears throat> Trade with the binding mummy, sure. Make a warrior, you got it. Okay, okay, okay. We're, we're, we're fine, we're fine. I mean, we're not fine as long as this thing's just sitting here. Eight of our lands are gone at least. It's only nine in the deck. Okay. Okay, so yeah, we're bringing in Gideon's Defeat. It's Mighty Leap a thing? Not really. Oh, Finish is still in the graveyard. Forgot about that. That's less than ideal. Uh, so you're coming in with that. I will block. What are you going to do about it? Not even going to give lifelink. But why? Passing the turn, but why? But why? Stupid planes. Um, Okie dokes. We are gonna bash in. Bashing in just isn't gonna work. Like, we're not racing the stupid lifelinking mummy. And we're too open to just, like, getting snapped at. Oh, hey, we're dead in a few turns off Afflict. That's fun. Isn't that special? What do we get? It's a Quarry Beetle. That's cool. That's pretty cool. We can get the Cradle back and make another zombie. Also, it's a 4-5, in case you didn't notice. Oh, there's a forest in here, too. Um, Yeah, let's get a Cradle back. Yes, please. All right. Now we're going to get in for three. Okay, so next turn we can make a zombie. Um, you got a 1-1, one, one, sure. <clears throat> Land, sure thing. You're gonna deadlands my Avenger. Uh, this getting lifelink and death touch sucks. You're gonna finish my beetle, right? Because finish was still in the graveyard. Unfortunate. So we have to kill that eternal. 
So we'll have to trade here. They won't attack in with that. Um, don't think they'll come in with that. Maybe they will. We'll see. We'll see. Holding out longer than I expected. That camel did its job. In with just the warrior. You got it. Down to nine. And a pass of the turn. Cool. What do we get? It's an overcome. Not quite what I want, but sure. Uh, we want a lot more creatures than we currently have. That is only 16 damage represented at the moment. How do we flood the board and continue to live? It's a good question. Uh, well, you're going to have to show me a trick here. The trick is give it lifelink. Sure. Creature dead. Get in there. Come on, something. Sure. Pass the turn. You got it. We are holding out here, but it's going to be a challenge to actually pull it off. Dead stalwart, sure thing. So they're just going to try to pick away at me with 1-1s. One uh, I will block one of said 1-1s. One so that on taps next turn. Oh, that could get me back into the game. That could definitely get me back into the game. So what does next turn look like with an overcome? 5, 10, 15, 16. 16 plus we gain 6. That's pretty good. I'm going to come in with them just to get some damage done. Might be walking into a sandblast. Nope. Take them to 17. Got a creature off the board. <clears throat> They're full up on lands. Coming in for two lifelink. Well, if they deal two and gain two a turn, and I deal four and gain four a turn, that's a race that's in my favor. But I'm betting they're going to play something. They sure are. Ooh, camel, you say. Can we live the turn? So, like, we drop camel... And then just don't attack. And then we can gain 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We can gain 11. Can we live through the turn? One card in hand. And they're going to make a 1-1. One, one. Or do I just want to gain the four life now? I will pass the turn and see what they do. They're going to make a 1-1. One, one. That's going to be exerted. Appeal to, the, appeal to authority would be a decent first start, too. 
They're going to come in for three. Two cards in hand. Um, I'll block with the Avenger and kill it, and then they can bring it back all they want. Alright, this is the game that gets us back in. These two dudes here. Dutiful Servants. Okay. One card left in hand. And we hit a Plains. So, we can make this a 6-6, six, six, which makes it invincible. And we can make this a 5-4, which demands a double block, and we get to kill something. And we're going to gain 11 life. If they just take it, we're going to take 2, 4, 6, 7. I feel like it's the only way we start to get back in. Gain a whole bunch of life. Oh, come on. Ugh. <laughs> Impeccably timed, opponent. Impeccably timed. Take five. Take four. I go up to ten. <sighs> okay. Okay. Opponent back in top deck mode. Did they top deck good? They top decked real good. Real good. Real damn good. As good as good but could possibly good. I will take six. You can gain two. You can gain four. Literally nothing saves us. Barf! Barf. Well, we held out a hell of a lot longer than I expected, at least. But let's try again uh, for game number four, five? Game number five against Black White Zombies. Let's try to pull it out. Gideon's defeat in Overcome. You just don't do it. You just don't do it. All right. We are going to play first. This is a... This is a hand that I'll keep, and I'm going to feel real bad about it. MTGO. Remember what we talked about, about the whole cool thing. Remember what we talked about, about the whole cool thing. MTGO. Mummy Paramount, sure. What are we going to get? We get... Nope, MTGO is not cool. MTGO is a dick. Whatever you heard about MTGO being cool, no, don't believe it. MTGO is just a dick. In for three. In for two. And probably has a nice fancy three drop. Yup. We draw nothing. Pass the turn. Yay. And this, boys and girls, is why you don't keep two landers. I don't care what various streamers will tell you that a two lander is an instant keep. They're wrong. They're wrong. You have to really be careful, especially on the play, about keeping a two lander. Taken six, down to 12. Steward of Solidarity, sure. What do we get? We hit a Gideon's defeat. We'll pass the turn. Yay. And we'll exile the Unwavering Initiate. Oh, we get to discard too. Sweet. Getting there. Swinging with that, I dare you. Yeah. Let's block and kill that. You're not okay with that. You're going to impeccable timing. Could you be more of a jerk? Gideon's defeat you. Down to eight. Almost lethal on board. 
See ya. What was on top? If we had, yeah, cool. Awesome. Don't keep two landers. I don't care what various streamers say. Do not keep two landers. You need multiple plays off those two lands. Uh, yeah, I really should have mulled that, but I know I would have gotten yelled at had I have mulled it. So anyways, that sucked a lot. Let's go on to match three against another Blackway Zombies deck.